don't know. A lot of you might have seen me before. You know, might have heard some of my shit. Heard me thrashing on them shits. Call me Gutter. I prefer Godzilla. But, you know, informally with a group called the Society of Invisibles. You know what I mean? I left the group about a year and a half ago due to, you know, creative differences. And, um... You gotta ask who I am, man. You ain't really on your shit. You feel me? Now you come to Arizona, ask who Gutter is. They gonna tell you. Be calm, Gutter. Call this guy, Gutter. You know, man, I got the name Gutter. Basically, when I was locked up, you know what I'm saying? Before I was, I was trying to think of some, you know, what I mean, different names and shit to use. But at the time, I couldn't think of shit. So. I have my homeboy Castro from Broadway, he from South Phoenix. Shout out to my homies from the Broadway, you know what I mean? Southside, um, Big Castro, you know what I'm saying? We was trying to think of names and whatnot. All he kept saying was, yo, your shit is gutter, you know what I mean? Your shit is gutter, your bars are brutal, nigga. Your shit is gutter. So, you know what I mean? From that, the name stuck. And then, um, plus, you know, getting it in in the streets. You know what I mean? We, we from the gutter. We do real gutter shit. I mean, I, I, I'm the epitome of the gutter, you know what I mean? Come fuck with me for a minute, man. I'll show you how I do it, man. But the streets inspire me, man. People always ask me what inspires me. I tell them, you know, the shit that I've been through, the shit my people's been through. A lot of people got me misconstrued like they know me or whatnot or what I've been through. But trust me, homie, I'm from a real hood. I'm from a good hood. And where I'm from, they get it in. And it ain't no... Gun laws or nothing like that, baby. It's legal to carry them out here. Where you from? From Arizona, homie. I'm East Side Naked City. You know what I'm saying? I migrated from Yuma to Phoenix. You know what I'm saying? To basically when I was about 17, I did a couple years in Adobe Mountain, which is a juvenile correctional facility out in Phoenix. You know what I mean? And, and basically, Phoenix became my home after that. You know, I had some stints in New York. Shout out to my Brooklyn dudes, you know what I mean? Nell Brooks, you know what I mean? The GBA, my, my man Napalm all day. He knows V Kong, so shout out to Brooklyn, J. Ronan, etc. Rock Marciano, Coyle was popping, man. The album's bananas. I mean, of course, you can get your haters out there. To, you can get your people that might not like it. I understand everyone ain't gonna like the shit. Everybody got an opinion. Everybody, you know what I'm saying, isn't gonna feel it. Some might love it, some might hate it. That's what it is, but, you know what I mean? Me personally, you know what I mean, listening to the shit a billion times already, the shit is bananas, straight up. So, hopefully y'all motherfuckers will like the shit too, and if you don't, you can eat a dick. You know, working with Blue Sky Black Death was a real good experience. Uh, basically, I hooked up with him, you know what I mean, through Chuck Wilson. Um, after talking to Kingston and on the phone, you know what I mean, uh, a couple times, we started getting a rapport. And then, shit, man, basically, I, I left it open for them to do what they wanted to do on the album as far as beats-wise. You know what I'm saying? Uh, and, and they created a masterpiece. You know what I'm saying? 12, 12 bangers. And and basically, I mean, it was a real good experience working with them cats, man. I'm gonna fuck with them in the future as well. You know what I mean? They know it's all love, so shout out to Blue Sky Black Death. You know what I mean? Make sure you guys cop that album September 2nd on Baby Grand, bitch. Me and Vinny Pez, I hooked up with Vin. Shit, I know Vin for about four years now. Um, basically, I met him when I was touring with the Society of Invisibles. Um, we went on tour with them a couple of times with Jedi Mind Tricks. Uh, I hooked up with Vinny, you know what I'm saying? Uh, you know, they'll tell you firsthand that sometimes I'm a little, you know what I mean? <laughs> I get a little on some other shit sometimes, man, but long story short, to my peoples, you know what I'm saying? They've been good to me. I fuck with Vin. And, uh, you know what I'm saying? Once it was just natural that we would do a song together. Plus, the most important thing I wanted motherfuckers to know is I kept getting these comparisons. Oh, you sound like Vinny Paz. Oh, you sound like this person. You sound like that. Like, motherfuckers, I sound like me. You hear me? I'm not changing my voice to rap. This is me, baby. 
So that's why I put Vinny on the song because I definitely wanted people to hear the difference. Plus, it's a hot collab, man. Two of the underground giants, you feel me? So I'm coming. Shout out to Vinny Paz, man. Jedi Mind, AOTP, all of y'all niggas, man. What's poppin'? Favorite track of my album, I say probably. Um, I like a lot of them the most, you know what I'm saying? I like all of them, but I have my favorites, I think. Uh, honestly, I, I'm fucking with the Riddler. That shit is bananas, you know what I'm saying? Uh, where I'm from, that shit. You know what I'm saying? I spit, I spit the truth on that shit. I gave y'all a glimpse of where the fuck I'm from on that shit. You dig me? Come on, man. Ain't no one out here in Arizona rap like that.